good morning students my name is vikas patak and i am your new it teacher okay so let's uh, start with the today's date what is the date of today 23rd march 2023 and now we will move to our topic so students uh, you all you must remember what we have uh, what i taught you in the last previous class and we are talking about the objects and their properties and objects and property are the part of oops object protein to pro programming so how can you identify any object i already told you in the last class tell me what is the name of this object can you identify this object pen. what is it this is pen very good and this is bottle i can't i can't say this is a pen because of its properties its properties is not matching with the properties of object so any anything any entity of, of the word that has some specific type of properties and that properties identify its class that property identify its class for example each and every object what what we can use for the writing purpose they can be identified as a marker okay if everything that i can hold which is used to hold the water for the drinking purpose we can identify that is a bottle so these things these properties are basically identify only a class and object is a member of that class okay so when we talk about the objects we have to we have to point out basically two main objectives of object first one is properties and next one is its function so we have already studied about the properties of object so now today's topic is the function of object function of object functions so students you already know any object have must have some kind of function for example if i am using this marker the main function of this marker would be would be that it is able to write on the desk agar ye write karne mein possible nahi hai that then i can say this is not functioning well take it is outdated or it is now uh, need to be updated okay so function function identifies the working of object working of object what is the working of objects this is identified by the function of the class so every class must have properties and must have the function so students we can categorize the function in two parts two parts first part is class class functions or class methods and another another one is instance functions इंस्टेंस और इसे को हम कह सकते हैं ऑब्जेक्ट मैथड्स ऑब्जेक्ट मैथड्स ओके सो क्लास एंड इंस्टेंस मैथड्स सो वॉट इज द क्लास मैथड्स द क्लास फंक्शन और क्लास मैथड्स आर द मैथड्स विच आर एसोसिएटेड डायरेक्टली विद द क्लास ऑफ द ऑब्जेक्ट नॉट इंडिविजुअल ऑब्जेक्ट बट द इंस्टेंस प्रॉपर्टीज और इंस्टेंस मैथड्स आर द मैथड्स विच आर विच आर एसोसिएटेड विथ इंडिविजुअल और पर्टिकुलर ऑब्जेक्ट for example if we i see this is a class class of students so this is a board board is a common property of the whole class if we rub this board all object this matter get disappear to all of all of the objects but if i talk about this is your phone or this is your copy so this is your copy separately and this is your ones so these are the separated or instance type of properties of object that can be duplicated or that can be shared that can be not shared among the multiple objects so class methods are the method that can be shared with, between multiple objects among the multiple objects but the instance methods are the methods which can not be shared between the objects okay so i think you understood this topic and i will carry on further topic in next class so students today's assignment is that you have to write you have to write the name of any write name of name of any five objects and their properties and functions the object may be anything what you see nearby you and or even or your home or your class also 